Okay, this is a new omen. Uh, I mean, for the today it's new. This is the 17 inch for the Intel 11 series, a 3070 graphics card. Um, I've already taken the eight screws out in back. But you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then, like this corner for me came up pretty easy over here. And then take a little little deal right here. You could use a credit card to be able to pop it off. I had to go around this side, on over to here, to here, and didn't have anything sound like it broke. Like other laptops, whenever you try, you'll hear a bad cracking sound. This one I didn't have a real bad cracking sound, but I took it real easy all through here. Don't see any broken little parts. And what I'm doing is I'm going to upgrade the hard drive well add in um, this one terabyte and even though I'm not going to be in the uh, 4.0 slot I'm going to put a 4.0 in uh, I'm not sure which one it is well I can tell right now this is going to be our 4 slot um, first thing that you need to do is remove the power because there's a lot of people that will spark the system changing out the ssd hard drive once you do that you bring it open and here's our power button you hold it down for a few seconds make sure nothing comes on you've been discharged now i'm in a high humidity area so we don't have a lot of static here and i don't have a lot of carpet i have a lot of hard floors and here we go i'm gonna all the screws were very easy to come off. Nothing was hard like it was going to strip off. So I have this with a little magnet on it. So bring this up and right here you have a little bit of tape. Now that's to go against your um, RAM processor, stuff like that. You'll see right here it says Gen 3. If I take this one off over here, which already has like fingerprints and stuff on it, um, that's that's not from me, so if I had to, I can probably find out who, who built this one. Uh, but it also already came with a screw, so you don't have to worry about whenever you're buying to have a screw or not. Now, these are pretty easy to install. You just put it in, slide it in, and push it down. As long as it slid, slid in all the way. Now, with this, I'm going to take this coating off. Now I bought this guy right here because it comes separate with this guy. So in case I needed to put it on, I could, but I'm going to try it with this because it's, it's copper. I mean, copper is great for displacement of heat. So now, let's see, this other one, just looking at that setup is, so this down here and get to line up yep it's on there yep little sticky pad and right in I don't have a GoPro yet so um, put this back in don't over tighten this stuff. They're tiny screws. But here you can see the the fan systems, the cooling. I mean, it, everything looks pretty good in this. So now we put the power back in. 